Hello and welcome to Bike Nation. Now, on a lot of the helmet reviews from the medium to premium brands, we often mention pin lock insert lenses. Now, if you don't know what a pin lock insert lens is or how to put one into your visor, then this video is for you. Now, if you're new to motorcycling or an experienced rider, there's always the issues of mist building up onto the inside of your visor, which is both hard to see through and pretty dangerous. <sighs> as you can see. Now there are a number of different options available to you. Number one is you can crack your visor open slightly, let the wind blow in and that will clear the mist away. But another option is to buy an insert lens, a fog or mist resistant insert lens. You can get some that glue onto the visor themselves or you can get pin lock insert lenses. These really are market leaders, fantastic bits of kit and you can get them for different helmet brands including HJC, RI and Shoei as well. Now I'm gonna show you how they work. This one here is a Shoei pin lock lens. And first thing you can see when you have a look up close is the gasket. Now this essentially is a silicon bead that goes around the outside of the insert lens and that will form an airtight seal between the insert lens and the visor, a bit like you're double glazing at home. Now the insert lens comes looking a bit like this. This is an HJC one. It's got a yellow bit of film on there that you peel back slightly before you put it onto the visor itself. I'm going to show you how to do it using this showy helmet visor. So here's the visor, here's the insert lens. Let's get up close and personal. To begin with you need to have a pin lock system so you need to have these two pins. Now the first thing to do is give the visor a bit of a clean and also make sure you haven't got your grubby mitts on the insert lens. This is a bit mucky but don't worry about it, it's just an example. Then all you do is you open the visor up slightly like this and you attach one end of the pin lock to the pin. Then bending the visor itself and the lens, you attach it in this side too and then when you let go it snaps into position. And from there you can see you've got this airtight seal around where the pin lock is sitting. And now all I have to do is show you exactly what happens if I were to breathe on it like before. <sighs> and from here you can see that the mist is all around this area of the visor but not where the insert lens is. Now these insert lenses work a little bit like a sponge, they soak up the moisture which means over time they'll start misting up again. All you have to do when that happens is bend your visor back, peel off the insert lens like so, dry it out put it back in again and it will start working like new. Now if you've got any questions get in touch with Bike Nation, have a look at the Bike Nation channel and we're all over social media so Facebook, Twitter and more. Until next time, do take care.